Hello, this is Stephen Bedard, and uh, welcome again to my video blog. Um, right now, I am in downtown Toronto. I'm about to go into Toronto Chinese Baptist Church, where I'm just beginning three months of ministry. I'm not preaching this morning, but I'll be going in there and being introduced to the congregation. And I'm excited about this time. Uh, my friend Nolan Lee, who is the pastor of the English congregation there, has asked me to come in for the next three months. And what I'm especially excited about is that Nolan has a vision for what he wants to see happen in terms of uh, his congregation and discipleship and Bible learning and all of those things. And basically he's asked me to come in with sort of an apologetics focus. Not that I'm going to be talking specifically about apologetics or using that name. But I'm going to be having that kind of focus in my messages, in my Sunday morning sermons, and also the uh, the uh, adult Sunday school that I'm going to be teaching. Uh, we're going to be looking at some of the hard questions of Christianity. And what I really appreciate about Nolan and asking me to come in and do this is that he's not giving in to this idea that congregations are biblically illiterate and so we should just give them what they want and stay with felt needs and um, really dumb down our messages as much as possible so that uh, people won't feel like things are going over their head. Well, in my opinion, if you do something a little bit over their head, maybe they'll reach up and grab it. Maybe they'll actually grow and learn and to be able to move beyond where they're at at the time. And this is really the vision I have. Now, I, I'm not saying that uh, preaching about felt needs is completely wrong. Uh, there are times to do that. There are events that take place in the church or the community, and you have to address those needs. I have no problem at all with those kinds of things. But we also have to increase the knowledge that people have in terms of Scripture and how to interact with Scripture, how to interpret it, and how to apply those things to the tough questions of life. I've been doing some research on discipleship and it's been really interesting to see what the topics are that people are uh, commenting on as being the most important. Now, uh, prayer is actually the number one uh, result so far, but not far after that is biblical interpretation and biblical knowledge, that people see that as an important uh, important need in the church for people to learn about. So I'm going to try to focus on those types of things and I'm not going to ignore prayer. I have uh, actually some ideas of what I can do in terms of helping people with prayer and uh, knowing me you won't be surprised that my focus is going to be upon uh, biblical prayers and so I'm looking forward to that. But you be watching for that. I'll give you lots of information as those projects uh, come ahead. But Right now, uh, if there's pastors watching, I want to encourage you to uh, to preach the word and to teach your congregations and, and move them up. Don't just get them where they're at right now. Try to move them along so they have greater knowledge of the scriptures and greater knowledge of how to apply the scriptures to life. We have to look at both of those things. We can't just focus on one or the other. We have to build that bridge between the Bible and and real life. And that's my goal as I'm going to be ministering at Toronto Chinese Baptist Church uh, for the next three months. And I hope, pastors, that that's your goal for your church, wherever you might be. Uh, thanks for listening to this video blog, and I hope that you check out my website at stephenjbedard.com. God bless.